Hey there, good afternoon everyone. Welcome to Prog Monster. My name is Murph. I am the host of this show, a show dedicated to progressive rock and other forms of rock music. So we're back with our series, which is Dynamic Duels, in which we pick a great frontman, kind of the leader of the band. He usually is the big singer. In this case, he is the singer. And uh, yeah, overall the whole leader of the band, and he's accompanied by a great guitar player. Either the guy's a great riff master, or maybe he's a great soloist, or maybe just writes great music, or maybe does all of these things. He may even be a good vocalist as well. But generally speaking, I'm going with that great singing vocal, uh, singing frontman, and that great guitar player. And today I've chosen a band some people may not think of as being in this particular genre or this particular series but I think they're really good and that's the knack and I've chosen of course Doug Feeger who plays rhythm guitar in this band but also is the lead vocalist and a strong vocalist he is he has very good projecting voice um, and he has that kind of voice that suits the music perfectly you know um, I think his voice is because it falls within the range that most people can reach a lot of people love to listen to this because they can sing along with it and that is one of the re main reasons I've liked the knack is because of the ability to sing along with the vocalist here um, Doug Feeger now the other member of the band who goes with this dynamic duel Burton Aver, who is the lead guitarist of the band called the knack of course um, the thing about him I like is that not only does he write all those catchy kind of riffs that you hear throughout throughout the knack um, uh, in my Sharona she's so selfish uh, Otara you know the list is endless um, well not endless but most of the songs that they write and do have that kind of rifting that's really dominating for their for the group as a whole but he also has that amazing gu uh, guitar solo um, never displayed better than it was on my Sharona where it's just it goes right off and he goes off and off and off on this it's so good that's why I always kind of hate these sometimes you'll hear um, some of these radio versions where they cut the solo out I'm sorry but the solo ma makes that song great uh, to cut that solo out just really tears away from the song and then you're left with the shell and the shell as good as it is doesn't really compete with the entire song with the solo in there and he's 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 a very to me he's a very underrated guitar player and I think it's because of the way his mannerisms yeah he was dressed to the nines and dressed up like the rest of them that black and white kind of almost waiter outfits but and uh, but he um, he when it came time to cut those guitar solos loose he was the man man a really good guitar player somebody I think uh, deserves a lot more attention than he get to, than he does get I often wonder what he would have been like if he played with some some more heavier bands uh, bands that you know where the soloing was more dominating whether he would have stepped up to the plate and knocked it out of the park I think he would have that wasn't his style of music so he never went there but the stuff he did with the knack was really catchy the rifting amazing the soloing fantastic and not he didn't play with a lot of distortion or a lot of acoustic stuff just that really solid rock and roll guitar with those rock and roll solos and the 50 stylish stuff you know so to me He's a guy who needs to be in the on this uh, on this dynamic duo thing, and Doug Feeger, who has that great voice for that poppy music, power poppy music, that people found so catchy and just love to sing along with. And I, of course, fall well within that realm. These there's many songs by this group that I like to sing on occasion. When I when I hear it, it just automatically takes over. So there you have it, the Knack's dynamic duel of Doug Feeger 
and Bert and Navir playing together for today's dynamic duel. And I hope you like this. If you did, please like and subscribe. It's much appreciated. And this, of course, will come out on the 11th, which is, or is this the 11th? No, this will come out on the 10th, sorry. The 11th was um, Tuesday, which is tomorrow. Or actually, this will come out tomorrow. That will come out on the Tuesday, the next one. So I hope I haven't sufficiently confused everybody. I've done a good job myself, confusing myself. But anyways, this is the uh, day 21, or the 21 band coming out on day number 10. The Knack, Bert Navarres, and Doug Feeker. So have yourself a good day. And I hope to see you again on the next episode. Take care.